Hello Aries, I am super excited to get to talk to you first. Yes, you're the first sign of the zodiac, but more importantly, the message this year is coming directly at you. Because of the last seven years, like I talked about in the beginning of the introduction, Uranus has been in Aries, been in your sign. So the last seven years, you can probably raise your hand and say, yeah, I've been through a lot, a lot of changes, a lot of intense relationships, a lot of times that I thought I was going to fall off the cliff hanging by one finger, and yet here you are still standing. Here you are still standing, and as we move into 2019, I hope that you are able to fully claim your identity. Now, Aries, you guys stand alone. You have to remember, Aries is ruled by the ram. So when we think about the ram, we think about the big ram with those big horns. He's up on the top of that mountain. Any others that try to get up, they know how to buck them right off, don't they? It's kind of a game, but at the end of the day, the Aries rises to the top. And so as we speak, going into 2019, you are ending this chapter of learning these lessons. In a way, you're getting the keys to the city. Now I say in a way because we also have to be very responsible with the keys to the city. And this year, I believe you have opportunities like no other. So first of all, I wanna talk about Mars. The planet Mars is an eight week cycle and it takes two and a half years to get back in your sign. As we start January 1st, 2019, out the gate, Mars is in Aries. And this will continue until February 14th. You've been trying to turn that key and to get that car to start. Well, as we move in to the first of the year, boom, va boom, you are running. Okay, feel that engine running. Don't be afraid because it's finally your time. It's finally your turn. Now for Aries, I see a brand new start, a totally different journey. You might have thought you were going this way and all of a sudden you're going this way. What happened? <laughs> what happened is you've grown, you've matured. You've had to deal with all of those starts and stops and starts and stops the last seven years. But every time you took those three steps forward, you learned something. And now all of those steps that you've been taking are finally laying the foundation that you've been waiting for. You are finally building the empire. Often the Aries gets, you know, gets blamed for being distracted all the time, never able to stay in one place, you know, starting something and not finishing it. Well, guess what, Aries? That is exactly what you need going into 2019 to use all of your gifts. This is the person now that can juggle all kinds of things, that can lead different groups, lots of different groups, that has the discernment now to not, to not allow the wrong people to come in your life. They kind of have to check you know, their shoes at the door, don't they? Find out who they are now. You're strong enough to say you know, what you will and won't do. So I am really excited for you, Aries. Um, the other thing I wanted to give you as we look ahead into 2019 is from October 4th to November 19th, planet Mars, we're following Mars in this video, through 2019 will be in Libra. That is your seventh house. So this October, beginning November, is an amazing time for you to finally collaborate, to get all of those things together. Aries often wants to work alone and it's hard for them to let other people in. It's hard for them to let other people help. But for the way for this to work and for the doors to open, it requires you to lead and it requires you to receive equally, to give and to listen. <laughs> so you are moving into an amazing opportunity I see the internet all over. I see coaching. Your brain right now is working at such fast speed and you are able to handle all of these different things coming at you now. Everything you have worked for, Aries, is finally coming forth and being appreciated and recognized. So Aries, 
2019 is going to be a great year for you. There's nothing stopping you and you're finally able to get your foot on the ground and put all of this together. You've worked hard and now it's going to pay off.